Um, there's a there's a, a perception about finishing fifth that it's a, a, being in the Europa League. It's almost like a booby prize. A what? A booby prize. What's that? Um, it's not a real prize. prize that you wouldn't want. A prize that you wouldn't want. Yeah. Oh. A prize that you wouldn't want. But the actual possibility to go for a European trophy is not something that you ever turn your nose about. No. I I bought a booby. <laughs> <laughs> I needed to become fifth to learn that word. So um, yeah, um, and not for me. I understand. I understand where you're coming from. This is football is like that. On the level we we usually uh, performed. It's about Champions League and blah 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 because of the money, because of the opponents, all these kind of things. Um, and it's not that I followed now in the last four years group stage games of European leagues a lot when you are in the Champions League we have a lot of things to do but I love the I love European competitions and for me that's no different to be honest I know when you play it it's no different so you can build with difficult opponents different countries probably um, and in the end a massive prize to win a massive prize to win and not that I say now um, we will do that, just we will try it. Definitely, definitely, and that's all. And I'm 100% sure in a moment people saying, oh, yeah, it's European League. First whistle, European night, Thursday night, whoever's the opponent, Enfield will be rocking. And it's all I need. That's all I need. And if, if somebody wants to go through the whole year and think, yeah, but it's not Champions League, I, I cannot help that person. Sorry, I, 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 don't, I don't know how you can help. Um, Life is like this. You try everything until it's decided. Then you accept it and go from there. If you're constantly worrying what you could have done different, then all these kind of things, and if we would have, and if there are all these, all these ifs, are absolutely not important anymore. They are not helpful. If it's not helpful, knock them out. So I'm looking forward to the new season. I'm really looking forward to the new season. That's, that's all I need. And I don't think, yeah, maybe here, we, we don't we don't put 100% attention on or stuff like this. No, nope. we will be all in. We understand that we have to improve. And if we improve from the point where we are now, that will be probably okay or better. And that's exactly what we have to do. And from there, we want to go. We want to make steps. We want to make steps. How is that? If, if, there's, if you change coaches, then always you have these kind of new starts, things like this, everything is... What is that? I was shaking through, and then um, and then we go from there again. And it's like, it's, but we do that ourselves. It's fine, it's fine. And now it's a different competition. Well, who cares? Um, and let's go for that. And I'm, I'm really, I'm really super excited about that. Um, cannot say that differently. Ideas where I want to go, nothing more than on holiday because everything this year was long. This year was you know, there were moments in the season, but I thought it's five seasons. That's true as well. But that's long ago. So we really found our way back to. In our, in to 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 use our our skills again in the right way. Now it's interrupted by a summer break and by a few international games and stuff like this. And then we come together again, and that's a must be a full throttle start, whatever that leads to. Then first games and stuff like this. It's not about the first game. We have to be we have to win the league or whatever. That's not possible. But just to show we are back, and that's what I want to show. Good. Apologies for this, but the obvious reaction with Mo is that he's, he's unhappy not being in the Champions League. So, <laughs> you, no worries that no. players of like, obviously his age. He wouldn't. He would not. I I, I, could, I, I only heard what he said. I couldn't read anything I, or not hear anything that could lead in that direction. How is that? Mo loves being here, and Mo was part of. He said apologies for what we did. Not apologies, what the other guys did, um, and uh, but I had to go with them. Not at all. It's all fine. If ever, if ever would now, it, I, it's not more, but the player would come to me. Oh, we didn't qualify for the Champions League. I have to leave. I would drive him to the other club. I would, I would say, take the key, come in the car where you want to go. I drive you. So because that would be something I I never could understand, like I would say, well, we didn't qualify for the Champions League. I need to work in the Champions League, so I go. I I'm responsible for this mess or whatever. So I can, you cannot go in these moments if that it's not the case with Mo, not at all, and nobody else told me 
they ask me if they can have a day or longer holiday or whatever, but nobody asked me if um, after holiday if they have to come back. So that um, was not in our conversations. This last one. Stefan? Yeah, it's progress. Uh, but I spoke yesterday longer to the dog. There will be around start the preseason, there will be parts of reintegration, but that will take time, so he's not in full training. That's the prediction in a moment. He's completely pain free, but we talk about a very young player and a very young body. So we have to be careful. Like we had, it's it's different, different um, um, injury obviously, but like we had to be super careful with Curtis. It's annoying for the player, like uh, really annoying, because you can train two days and then you need two days off because what? But you feel great, but it's just to make don't take any risk. That might be a little bit of plan for him when that exactly starts. I don't know. I hope that he can come with us in a in a training camp and can do there these bits. And from that on, pro progress, and then he should be fine for the start of the season. But um, it's, it's how it is with these with these kind of injuries. Um, there's no real <coughs> time line that you say after six weeks, uh, the, uh, whatever the the ligament is healed, and now from there we can go. We, we don't know that. You have to wait um, always for the next assessment and if you know that then you can go from there but it's it's positive so I think um, at the end of the preseason he will be in, then probably hopefully we got to already in full training and before that parts of training so that should be fine Hey thank you so much for watching check out redmanplus.com and if you join as a club legend on there at a yearly rate you'll be instantly emailed two codes to get yourself two free pieces of merch from redmenmerch.com boss of Liverpool t-shirts to sit in watch and listen to our podcast it's boss your boss See it on redmanplus.com.